Hello everyone, my name is Ryan Sweetlow and I would like to extend a very warm welcome to you all as members of the WIPS family. I'm the Deputy Head of Pupil Affairs. Along with Penny Villa, heads up pupil support, as well as several therapists, we comprise the WIPS support department. Penny and I have offices at the WIPS Pupil Centre. We work as a team, dealing with emotional, mental, and spiritual wellness of the WIPS. Welcome to the WIP Support Centre. It is here where the therapeutic team meet to discuss and plan individualised intervention programmes for those in our care. I am a registered counsellor and am responsible for providing academic support in maths and English for boys in grades 1 to 7 and emotional support for those who require these services. I truly believe that all children are capable of success. Some just need a helping hand or a gentle nudge to get them back on track. This is a school that believes strongly in holistic education, engaging with children on an academic, sporting and cultural level. It also means connecting with children emotionally. After all, it is only in, care, in a caring environment that our boys and girls can become confident young adults. It is only in a caring environment that they can learn to work hard and play straight. We place great value in this caring environment where children can grow and develop, make mistakes and learn and fall and then get up and start again. As Head of Pupil Affairs, I aim to foster relationships between your children. Learning to get along with one another is infinitely harder than the most difficult of academic challenges. Long after we have forgotten what we have learned in the classroom, we will still be challenged by the relationships that we face one day at university, in the workplace, and in our personal adult lives. We are committed to helping your children deal with conflict in their lives, no matter how young they are. We cannot promise a school career without conflict. On the contrary, it is only through conflict in our relationships that we start to grow as people, that we start to be more forceful, more intuitive, more assertive, that we learn to distinguish and discern, that we gain in confidence. On the subject of confidence, self-belief is vital and probably the most fundamental factor in lasting success and happiness. For many of us, it must be awoken and developed. Corrective action is critical as we teach boys about being accountable for their actions by giving something back, by paying it forward and by making amends to those we have hurt. We want to guide boys to deal with their feelings and speak about their issues as well as drawing strength from one another and the staff and we have a responsibility to help them to realize they can overcome life's obstacles. Hi, I'm Tremaine, the occupational therapist. And I'm Simone, the speech therapist. And let us show you our center. Please follow me. So this is where OT is and right next door is our speech therapist. At occupational therapy, we help our children with their sensory integration, we help them with gross motor and fine motor skills, as well as perception and school related tasks. We learn through physical activities and play. And at speech therapy, we have a look at articulation. So we look at speech sounds, we look at fluency and disfluencies, we look at language, we look at phonological awareness skills, as well as auditory processing skills as well. And we also learn through play, games, and lots of fun activities. So, my name is Lindy and I do emotional counselling with kids through play. So um, I help them with all kinds of emotional issues. We use a lot of fun activities, games, sand tray, role play, drawings, pictures, arts and crafts. Uh, so the kids have a lot of fun. Hi, I'm Sophie and I'm the 